basically my path up, you know, I'm still having a little trouble with it, but you know, I'm facing that over that adversity and just using my hands more, more. It's just a secret of a detackle, basically. It seems as if one of the storylines in the public has been a development of you, Heron, Gilmore, you guys. Where are you at in, in your process of development here in college football? Are you ahead of pace, below schedule? Where are you at? I mean, all three of us, you know, uh, we came in as freshmen, and we both work, all three of us is working hard to try to get up uh, up speed as an SEC uh, football player. But right now, I, I just say we in the mid-range, but as the week goes on, you know, we're getting better. Does it help to have several guys kind of vying for time at that one spot to kind of push each other? Yeah, you know, it's, it's like a competition every day. Each and every day it's a competition. It's like uh, you racing a motorcycle against somebody that says yours, his is faster. So each and every day we try to uh, at least, I won't say bet, but we at least try to throw, throw shots at each other and say, oh, man, I got you on that play, and, you know, stuff like that. Y'all's D-tackle rotation has been relatively thin so far, obviously, with um, a couple guys banged up. Y'all have to play. What is? What do you think the one or two things that Brick requires you have to be able to do to get on, you know, into the rotation? Uh, he just tell us to practice hard every day, each and every day. You know, even with the guys banged up. I mean, every everybody's banged up. It's SEC. You know what I'm saying? So everybody's gonna be banged up, but we try not to worry about the injuries. We just try to uh, move forward, and um, each week we try to win.